you've been back some here and there since you since your playing days uh, ended. But I guess what's it what's it feel to know that you're coming back for this moment and how what are your emotions kind of looking forward to tomorrow? Oh, well, you know what? Uh, I'm always excited to come back. You know, so you know when I when I left here after college and went on to play professional ball, it took me years to get back here. And uh, the city has made a lot of changes. The universe has grown. Um, uh, I've always considered Knoxville a home away from home for you. Uh, I've always seen a ton of love here. Four years. That was the best time of my life. Been here in college. What's your most vivid memory of the time at Tennessee? Most vivid memory. Um, I can remember the last game we played out in Washington. I was. Maybe start crying. We're going to get a chance to talk to these guys after today's practice. I guess. Can you give us a preview of what your message is going to be for them? Well, this is going to be a first for me. I don't really know. They're just going to wing it. Um, I don't believe I can say anything that, that's going to hurt these kids. I never had, never had an opportunity to speak to a professional basketball player as a youngster of their ages. So I know that they're going to be attentive. Um, just share what, what I know about how you prepare for games and how you have to be professional on both ends of the floor and off the court as well. They put both ends. Uh, they still have an opportunity to do something special. There was a situation where I got traded to Seattle and we were picked to lose more games than anybody in the, in the NBA. And uh, we jailed that end of the season. That's what's most important. You'll see Miami do that again this year. They'll come together towards the end of the season, get real strong. So you just got to keep working at it. We end up in the Western Conference Finals. You know, we were a 50-50 team. We won 41 games, lost 41 games. We were the number eight seed. And we were facing the number one seed. They beat us by 35 points in the first game. We went on to beat them three straight games. So anything can happen in basketball. You just have to go out and play as hard as you can be and try to limit your mistakes on the floor. How much have you kept up with the program? How much have you watched this year's team? And how much do you get a chance to do that? I honestly haven't had a chance to watch a game this year. I'm excited about getting a chance to see them tonight, I mean tomorrow. Um, but um, all throughout my basketball career, like as I said earlier, I play it. I can't remember many days not playing. You got to play as often as I did. It's kind of hard to take a job home with you. I'd rather watch a good movie.